when it comes to Christmas, they're telling us to shop early. Well, supply chain issues are impacting stock and prices. Small businesses locally are feeling the impact as well. ABC 13's Micah Hatfield spoke to a local toy store who says it's not all bad, however. Micah? Gina, if you walked into Tom Foolery Toys in Meyerland right now, like we've seen so many people do today, the shelves are stocked. The term supply chain disruption would not come to mind. But let me tell you, looks can be deceiving. In the last couple of weeks, I've seen quite a few orders that were placed in June for immediate ship, meaning I place the order, ship it today, and it's just now showing up. Owner Carol Staley says it's a daily job to keep her shelves stocked at Tom Foolery Toys and Books. Hey, it's good to see you. There are major delays in getting the product and prices are up. She says she's seen price increases from manufacturers as high as 20% over the last year. Um, a few customers have commented to us like, do you know that this is $9 more on Amazon? Prices on some toys have gone up at Tom Foolery, but not as much as some of the major online retailers. And it comes down to shipping. Freight has gone up, the product has gone up, and so it's a way sometimes online where um, for them to cover their quote unquote free freight, you are going to pay more for the product. Staley does not factor shipping into the price of the item. She instead charges a flat fee to get it to you. A shipping charge is not deterring people from shopping the Meyerland store online. We're shipping Virginia, Washington State. We even had one to Alaska. She attributes that to limited availability of products. People search online and Tom Foolery Toys and Books in Meyerland has what they're looking for. Unfortunately, this may not be the last holiday season that we're having this discussion. <laughs> the supply chain, we're kind of being warned by our manufacturers to anticipate it maybe through next Christmas.